guys, welcome to Random Lifestyle Vlog and uh, you probably are surprised as we are that we just changed our positions Yeah, our, our camera... we're very versatile Yeah, our cameraman um, Robert <laughs> actually our, told Your us to assistant, the yeah, assistant. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He actually told us to change the position here because of the lighting or something Yeah and who are we to argue? <laughs> yeah, who are we to argue? Yes, yeah. so anyway, uh, we have another advent calendar unboxing this time. It's Glossy Box. I hope you enjoyed the last, uh, the previous uh, unboxing that we did. Uh, we did enjoy it for sure. Yeah, so, yeah. <laughs> yeah a lot. So, uh, before we start, as usual, please uh, have a look at our giveaway that's happening at the moment. Link above our heads and below in the description box uh, also don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell if you want to see all the advent calendars coming your way and Arthur you probably want to say something now because in December I'm gonna be launching my YouTube channel I'm guilty <laughs> but yeah uh, you're going to do makeup, yeah, skincare. mostly makeup, skincare, and everything about beauty. Uh, so my YouTube channel is going to be launching in December. And uh, one of the first videos there will be a makeup that Arthur will perform on my face yeah. with the product that we'll find in those advent calendars. It's going to be exciting. And then you're going to do one makeup on me as yeah, well. Yeah, this will be like a more like uh, on the funny side, uh, I guess. <laughs> it's going to be a challenge. challenge. <laughs> so yeah. Uh, so without further ado, let's start. Let's go. Okay. So I'm gonna, is it heavy? It's a uh, heavy-ish. What do you think of oh. the design? It's like a marble thing. I do like the colors. It could be more glossy, uh, sparkly. Yeah, it's not very Christmassy. I would say it's like all the way around. And you just open it and you have like oh. drawers like this. Okay, I thought it, it's gonna be like 25. There is, but look. look. Ah, just okay. Here. Okay. Okay. So this is actually a good idea if you want to reuse this box, not as an advent calendar, but as just like a you for know makeup or yeah, something. Yeah, I'm going to probably do this. Yeah. So let's just show this because you know I don't know if you've seen the whole thing. Okay. So let's start. I... So what are we starting with like the first drawer or? Uh, number one. I think it, one. it was in the in the first drawer actually because I could see it. Yeah. It looks like seven, but okay, it's it's one. Yeah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> it's so quite. It's, it's not. It's not comfortable to take it out. Yeah. It's easier with the other ones. Number one, glossy box. It's quite big though. It is big and it's not comfortable to take it out. I'm Let's see, whatever. Open. Okay. Let's see. Oh, beauty blenders. Ooh. Hello. We like beauty blenders. That's everything. Yeah. Yeah. Should I put it back in the box or just leave it? No, no. Let's just we just leave it out. Just put, just ditch the box in the floor. Bam. Uh, yeah. So we have a beauty blenders, which is actually something very useful. You should change these quite often, right? Um, yeah, because they're dirty or just like make sure you're gonna wash them uh, after every single use because you can have some uh, allergies and some different stuff on your face and especially under the eyes because I did it, I wasn't washing mm. them recently and I was doing using like every day for yeah. the concealer and I like noticed I've got something under my eyes so yeah. you better like change it or wash it every I day I kind of, I wash it but you know even after like a couple of like weeks of washing these they actually become a little bit nasty and I can't really wash them properly like till they're super what clean kind of, depends what kind of uh, beauty mm. blender is that mm. I, uh, personally I don't know the brand, Brush Works and you've got three different beauty blenders the small one is under the eyes, uh, and those two for your for your face. Um, yeah, yeah, it's a nice set, and I'm glad they actually gave us like a whole set, not just a single. We did that before, like any beauty blender too. Mm, I think it, they actually give uh, these in glossy box recently, glossy box advent calendar. So I think last year they had a beauty blender too. So I think I've seen number two in here because I just had oh. a quick look, like just when after was actually unboxing the first box because it's going to be difficult. Go ahead. You go ahead and I'll just try to oh, locate the number. Difficult? I'll try to locate the, the other numbers. Right. There's loads of paper faster. and between the paper you just need to find the actual present for yourself. What have you got here? Oh, La Masca. Do you Ooh. like La Masca? I do like this brand. It's vegan. It's cruelty free, I think. And this is a liquid yeah. eyeliner. Okay, that's good. The liquid eyeliner. You can swatch it so that it's we can actually black. Take... Yeah. Obviously loads of blacks. I do like their packaging. Uh, I don't know if this eyeliner is actually going to be like any uh, um, anything spectacular Special. in terms of like packaging, but usually they have ni nice packaging. Yeah, it's Very just like a simple, simple one. black with like I'm gonna swatch it. Yeah. Mhm. Mm Shoop. Ooh, nice brush. So I think you can do a very thick mm -hmm. line. Nice. Shoop, shoop, shoop. Yeah, and it's very um, precise, so you can do different shapes as well. Okay. So yeah. 
So that was number two. I think number three was, yeah, it's here. <laughs> so I'm just doing like um, research before and you just keep, uh, you just focus on unboxing. Right, I'll okay, so on. number three. Don't mind me. <laughs> I'm just trying to find it. So you've got a sample. It's one. I'm wondering if it's going to be just one product or two like we had on the previous box. Uh, I can't pronounce This is Filorga, uh, NCEF Reverse, and this is Supreme Multi Correction Cream. So it's a face cream, a sample size, but again, Filorga is quite expensive brand, so uh, you know, the size is understandable in here, I guess. I think number, number four, four was here. Just, it, do you know the, the problem with that is you have to open these or uh, these drawers, like, um, you know, fully open them to find the numbers. What they could have done is just put like number, like a first. First, like four One, two, three, or five four numbers, or yeah, in the first yeah. drawer, and then like, yeah. Pixie! Oh, I love this brand! Oh, uh, it's like, look, it's like an oil or something yeah. inside. Oh, okay. So, what is this? this is Glow Mist with uh, Propolis and Argan Oil. Uh, nourishing Mist, yeah, it's a very nice brand. It's quite. Some of the products are quite priceless. I, I, this is actually really, really weird because uh, these products, the packaging looks super cheap. But they're not cheap. Like, they're, they're not cheap, they're very good. And you can get them personalized. So uh, when PR packaging are coming, they're coming like with the really? name Pixie for Paulina, for example. My friend from Poland, uh, she, she she got lots of products. Really? Them, yeah, and they're very personal. And on the packaging, it's written Pixie for Paulina. Oh, that would be it's cool. It's really cool, and it's really cool. And those products are very nice and very recommended. Oh, I would like love Pixie to personalize this for me. <laughs> uh, I was so excited that I forgot to find number five. <laughs> five. Uh, so we we'll have to do it now. No, um, no, nope. uh, it's the last one. It always happens. Okay. Oh god, these are like yeah, not easy it. to open. Okay, I'm just picking it up for you because it's on my side. But Grazie, you know. senorita. Mm -hmm. Number five. Mm. Need to double check later on. There's yeah. no leftovers. Uh, we've got uh, lime crime. Lime crime. Okay. Gloss. Gloss in a red velvet. It's very Christmassy color. It's red. It's very red. Um, I think I assume it's going to be matte. It looks matte. Yeah. I'm curious what you're going Whoa. to think. Oh, that's that's nice. That's nice. That's nice. It is like a tip. Yeah, it's like a Christmassy vibe. Mm -hmm. Looks like blood. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Six. It's here. The massive one. Oh, the big one. Okay. Really uncomfortable unboxing. Yeah, <laughs> the pa I mean, I do like the box and the packaging and everything, but like the the idea of like just looking for those boxes is a little bit complicated. What is this? Hair apology, ten, intensive care. Ten in one leave-in treatment spray. Ten in one. Hmm. Ten in one. What does it do? Nourishing and rehabilitate critical processed uh, damaged hair from the very first use. So it's uh, healing very damaged hair. Like the packaging, very bright and pink. Mm. I don't know why 10 in one, because I can't really see 10 uh, advantages of this product, but um, like, you know, it's a marketing thing. What's number okay, number seven, surprisingly. Oh, seven. It's, <laughs> it okay. actually says seven, <laughs> it's not a number. So yeah. Okay, and we've got... Yeah, Glossy Box on brand, uh, Glossy Box Skincare, three in one moisturizer. I haven't tried anything by this brand yet. Um, and it plumps, primes and protects, apparently. Our lightweight 3-in-1 moisturizer nourishes your skin and prepares it for flawless makeup application every day. And this is 50 ml, so they're full size, which is good. I mean, quite obvious if they started their own brand, they will probably just put their own uh, product in here. That kind of makes sense, right? Does it remind you of something? Of a uh, glossy box packaging inside. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, I mean like any kind of brand. Uh, no, does it? Does it Anastasia remind... Really? Maybe? Okay, maybe. Oh, sorry. <laughs> okay, let's get another one. <laughs> number eight, right? We're looking yep. for number eight. And, um, yes, number eight, here, the big one. Number eight! I'm wondering who, who designed those boxes, who the creator of those Christmas yeah. calendars. Lots well, of paper. A lot of paper in this oh, one. Oh, there's nothing, it's empty. Kidding. I'm pretty scared <laughs> with this one. It's what is it? A bath bomb. Bath bomb. 
Okay, I Bubble do love. Tea. I do love. This is winter berries, bath, bath fizzer. I do like bath products. Uh, I think I mention that all the time. Uh, because I love taking my baths in winter, especially in autumn. Do you? So that's good. Yeah. <laughs> With a glass of wine and candles. Sure. Sure. <laughs> we all love it. I wouldn't have it any other way. So number nine. I think I've seen it somewhere, but where was that nine? Here. Nine. Nine, 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 nine. Ooh, there's another liner. Here we go. Eyebrow. Oh, but this is brow liner this time. Okay. Brow liner from MUA. Yeah, MUA makeup. Yeah, it's a very cheap one. Brow definer. Uh, don't know what shade is that. And it's going to take a lot of time to open it. Uh, we'll just skip it, yeah? Yeah, we just going to uh, skip this it. This is like a cheap Eyebrow. brand. It's not going to be no. probably You can accepted. find it in Boots. Ten. Uh, it's a big one as well. The colors are not like Christmassy though. No. They could do it more in the Christmassy vibe. I think the last year's I've found, I didn't have last year's one, but I think it was in a similar shades, like pink and gold. What do we have? Zo! No, 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 no! Zoiva! <laughs> Eyeshadow palette! Eyeshadow palette? Woo! Yes, bitch! <laughs> The okay. eyeshadows, like, Zoeva is very, very good, very nice brand. They've got cool brushes. Uh, the price is, like, you know, yeah. Uh, not but, the cheapest, not the, the most cheapest. Expensive. Yeah, yeah, but the quality is amazing. Um, so we've got a Screen Queen. Screen Queen or Scream? Screen. Screen, yeah. Screen <laughs> Queen! Woo! I like the packaging. <sighs> oh, it's not eyeshadow palette. It's a highlighter and bronzer, like a contouring and palette and blush. Yeah. Okay, it's nice too. I mean, I'm really hoping for a national palette that I will just nah. I will find it somewhere here. But yeah, um, this is a quite interesting blusher, don't you think? Like a like a really cold pink shade. It is. Or is it like a highlighter? It might be a highlighter. Look, it's not very pigmented. It was it this one? Yeah. Yeah. It's a highlighter. Yeah. They're very dry. Um, I think they're all highlighters a little bit. I mean, this one is more like a, uh, like, you know, the thing that kind of gives you this glow. It's not like a proper sculpting palette. Like Superior pigmentation, but easy to blend highlighting powder palette. Okay. Definitely. So it's... One, two, three. Um, yeah, there are highlighters. They're not very much pigmented. They give you like a little different shade. Shades. Yeah. Very, very pastely shades. Delicate. Oh. I'm disappointed. <laughs> you were counting in an eyeshadow palette all along. Yeah. So what so number was that? Nice number 10, 10 yeah? 11. 11? No, I have no idea where 11 is. I'm not really good at this and doing... Um, just looking for these things Ooh, in advance. Big. Okay, big one, 11 here. Big and light. Um, so this one is... Guess what? What is this? You'll be naked in a minute! <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> I don't know, what is that? That's a exfoli original coffee scrub, exfoliator oh. for smooth, glowing skin. Okay. What does My it say? Body. Get naked, get dirty, get rough, get clean. And there's like a picture of an ass. A an ass? Oh yeah, there is. <laughs> <laughs> and it's actually a clean ass. Clean ass, okay. <laughs> All right. Like a good clean 12 ass. Twelve here. A small one here. Small one, I think it's going to be a lipstick. Oh my god, what is the paper? No, it's not. It's a glow, watermelon glow, sleep, sleeping mask. Sleeping! <laughs> yeah, it's a, a um, glow recipe uh, mask with uh, alpha hydroxy acid and hyaluronic acid. So it's something that will just uh, kind of exfoliate your skin gently and also hydrate it. Uh, so yeah, I've tried that before, it's actually quite nice. So. Oh, the lipstick is drying matte. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, what, what, what number we 13. have now? 13, okay. Lucky uh, 13. Okay, I have 15. to just go through these again. 13. 18. Okay. Slide again. Oh, super tiny sample. Uh, so uh, it's a good jeans. Um, good God! <laughs> Glycolic acid treatment, uh, and this is again a sample size. Uh, so if you want to try this product, it's quite pricey, so that's good. Uh, the only it's thing I have to <laughs> <laughs> the only thing that I want to say is that in the previous advent calendar, Bears box, we actually had two of these in one. Yeah, we did. 
There was like this one and the one with retinol. Okay, number 14. Yeah. 14. So in box number 14, day number 14, is hand cream with organic apricot kernel oil and almond oil. Okay, what brand? Oh, this is e-cooking. So it's like a very natural brand. Uh, you can actually tell by the look, by the, just by the look at the packaging, it looks very natural, right? So it's very like natural ingredients and stuff. And these products are actually very good. Not all of them are great for my skin type, uh, but you know, I did, did use like a couple of them and uh, the quality is actually good. So, and hand cream these days. Very, very useful. Yeah. I found 14 like a minute before, but I lost it again. Okay, just, um, seriously, it's not, was it 15 now? 14, 15. What number are we on? 15. 15. Oh my God, this is getting really difficult now. I have 16 here. 21. No. Oh my god. Do you know what? I don't like this packaging. Like in oh. Okay, it's here. It's here. <laughs> I don't like uh, the way you have to actually look for the product. This kind of makes me a little bit frustrated. Especially when you just do unboxing and kind of want to find everything quickly. Yes. And we got. Oh my god! Really? Fenty Beauty? Ooh, wow! Okay. Match sticks, si ma ma match sticks, shimmer stick, and okay. triffin. So oh it's like God. a highlighter. Yeah. Wow! I've never had anything from Fenty Beauty. Oh, that looks very impressive. That looks Packaging impressive. is super cool. Yeah. It's orange. <laughs> <laughs> amazing, amazing! It's orange. Watch it. No, I mean I'm going to. I'm going to switch on your hand. Okay. Okay. So this is uh, I have something on my hand from like previous unboxing, I guess. I would say it's going to be for like a darker skin tone. Yeah, it's definitely for dark. I mean, it's not orange, but it's like a golden, okay. like a yeah, see, like a golden shade. Hmm. So uh, I think it's nice, but like for darker skin tones and for people with. Um, more like a warm tone, warm, warm skin tones, tones. Yeah. Because you know, if you just if you if you have like blue undertones on your skin, I don't think this will actually work with your skin very well. But in general, yeah, I mean it's Fenty Beauty. It's so Fenty Beauty, hey. And it's a full size. By Rihanna, so it's I guess. cool. Um, Number sixteen, I already 16. found this one. <clears throat> Amazing, very light. What is that? Bare minerals. And this is a primer by Bare Minerals, and this is 7 mils, a, a tiny sample of a primer. I do like it, but uh, honestly, this features quite a lot, and I have like three of these already. Full of smoothing. It's good though, it's good, yes. <laughs> okay, number 17 here. Found it before. Do we have 25? Yes, yeah, yeah, lucky. Shoop, 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 and here is. I don't know what is that. Oh, the body shop. The body shop uh, Himalayan Chocolate Purifying Glow Mask. I don't think I've seen anything very body shop so far in Advent calendars this year. So that's a good... I, I haven't tried this mask. I've heard many good things about it. And so I can't wait to try it. And it smells... If eucalyptus? Huh? Eucalyptus? Maybe. It's um... like a very mm, refreshing scent to it. Like menthol maybe? Something like this? Oh my god, I can't read because the... Levers are very very small. Uh, so this is organic normally, so you have you should use it quite fast. Yeah, because yeah, it otherwise gone. it's just gonna mm. be moldy. Okay. What number? Eighteen. Yes. <clears throat> I remember I had a face scrub from um, Body Shop, and I haven't used it because I forgot about it, and uh. it went went moldy actually. Well, sometimes I like, when I have like really good good like products or cosmetics, and I just left them because I didn't really want to use them too much because they were so special, and then they just go bad. So you, <laughs> you know how it feels sometimes, like you when you just buy something and like yeah, I'm just gonna like, keep it for like yeah. special occasions. Once a year. And then, <laughs> so not enough of those special occasions. And uh, we've got sleek, uh, and it's loose pigment and um, based based. That's the that's the shade. Okay, so another makeup item. Yeah. We have quite many makeup items, and I think you mentioned that I don't remember if this <clears throat> time or was in the previous box. Uh, quite many glossy, dewy, glowy products. Uh, as, you know. Was it before? I think it will, could have been before. I don't know. I don't know. But I think you mentioned that before. Yeah, so yeah. Loads. So it's a lot of like glossy stuff. I mean, it's glossy box, and you can kind of assume this. What number is this? Nineteen. Nineteen. Okay. 
Oh, this is actually quite handy. I mean, <laughs> maybe it doesn't. Oh, I do. I don't think it's a good idea, Arthur, because he will probably just leave a, a smudge of my makeup. But yeah, this is a good. Um, this is a actually quite a handy thing if you have long hair, mm -hmm. like I Better do. Fix your hair. Oh, thank you. If you have long hair, just like I do, uh, whenever you put like a sheet mask or like any type of mask on your face and you don't really want facial. to make your hair dirty, yeah. oh, really then cool. that's quite useful because it keeps your hair in place. 20. Number 20, so yeah. I hope we're recording this. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine at the end of like, Ooh, Huda Beauty! Ooh, okay, and it looks, it looks like it's a, a full size lipstick. It is a full size lipstick. In a shape, wedding day. Wedding day. I think it's gonna be. Nice Let's watch. The Huda Beauty, I like the packaging, but I always struggle to open this. But this is, you know, that doesn't really mean anything because I struggle with all the packaging. Um, so, yeah. I'm um, Huda Beauty on. lipsticks are very pigmented. Um, this is the full size. I just, I do like the way they look, you know. Like the ombre, you know. Right, so let's do a swatch. Do I have any space? Yeah, I do have space. Yeah, in between eyeliners. <laughs> oh, that's nice. That's a nice shade. I do like. like is it like your yeah. shade? Is it? Uh, a little bit similar, yeah. And this one is called. What is it called? Wedding day. Wedding day. Yeah, I like it. I like it. I think it's quite um quite wearable, quite like, like more like a daily lipstick. It's not. I wouldn't say it's nude, but um. Pinky it's more nude. like a pinky. Yeah, 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 yeah. But like like, like this the dirty pink yeah. kind of like shade. I like it. I like. I like it. I think it's quite wearable. Yeah. 21! 21! 21! I remember when I was 21. Yeah. I, <laughs> I just... What is this? Avant? Yes, Avant. And this is, again, a very expensive brand. Uh, so this is, you know, the creams. <laughs> the creams, like the full-size creams, are around like 80 to 100 pounds. This is, uh, this is 10 mils, but this is an eye product. So I'm guessing this is uh, quite expensive like this even this size quite expensive this is three and one hyaluron filler collagen eye formula and then there's, there's loads of fresh. products now in the market for your eyes yeah yeah and it says apply in the morning and evening onto clean dry skin around the eye area uh so this is 10 mils eye product i do prefer eye products when they're like 10 15 mils not too big because i'm never able to use the whole mm. bottle and it actually makes me quite annoyed Okay, so what was it, number 21? Yeah. I failed to find another one again. Uh, like the 20... 22. It's here. It's easier now because it's like almost empty, so it's easier to find for like... 22. 22. And... Something by Dermalogica, I can see. Yeah. Dermalogica, daily microfoliant. I don't know. Okay, so it's like an exfoliator, but you can... It's like gentle enough for you to use it daily. And it has a form of like a, a powder. You just put it in your hand, add a little bit of water, it, and you create like a paste. Right. And then just like uh, wash your face with it. Good idea. Yeah. Brightening powder, exfoliant. Yeah. Brightening. We you have we have lots of brightening stuff. Yeah. Brightening, glowy, glossy products. Twenty three. So the last three boxes. Twenty three is mascara. Okay, we haven't had mascara in this box yet. From so. Go Big or Go Home. Okay, so it's a KVD, a previous cut from D. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Black mascara, black plus black. Yeah. Okay. So we have a mascara, travel size, and then we have two last days, twenty four Christmas Eve. Twenty four. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna leave you twenty five. No, I'll no. open twenty five. Oh. Okay. Nail polish. Nail polish in a very nice shade. Uh, honestly, I do. I do. Uh, I'm not. Like, I'm not really great in doing my own nails. I just you've, you've have them done. Nice yeah, but I haven't done them. I just pay for them. <laughs> you know, it's like I'm not really good. But uh, if um, the lockdown strikes again, uh, I will probably just use this color because I. You're like gonna it. have no choice. Yeah, I like. Twenty-five. This. Twenty-five. Okay, open twenty-five. It's massive. It's the biggest one. It's the biggest one, yes, for sure. Vulture for two. <gasps> I'm, okay, I'm not gonna be excited. Again. Uh, I'm just gonna put it down. I don't know what's gonna be there. What is that? Eyeshadow. Yes, eyeshadow palette, finally. From Iconic. Ooh. 
Day to Slay eyeshadow palette. It's and a full size for sure. Yeah, this is a full size, beautiful looks with the 20 highly pigmented pink, peach, bronze, lots of shades. <laughs> <laughs> do, 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 do. Nice. Nice. Amazing. Nice. Very like wearable shades. Just watch some of them. I know you want to. <laughs> I know you want to. You always. Ah, it's. Mm -hmm. Blocada. It's Blocada. <laughs> Which one do we want to swatch? I don't know, swatch any. I want to try the gold one. Very soft, nice and pigmented. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Oh, Merlot. Merlot. And let's see. Oh, look, they have like alcohol names like Bellini, Merlot. Uh, not all of them, but like some of them. Ooh, Deep Soul okay. 24. Okay, this is 24 gold. Mm. Do you want to use my hand? Yeah, please. Um, this one, maybe. Gold. Just not gonna have a drink. And mm. okay, so it looks like this. What do you think? Uh, I really like it. I've never tried iconic London um, eyeshadow palette before, but it looks the metallics are pretty metallics nice. are very nice and intense. Mm -hmm. And you can actually create like a full full look with the uh, uh, with this eyeshadow palette, like a daily look, then yeah. transform it to like a night look, smoky eye with the bronze and some metallics. Very nice eyeshadow palette. And the shades are not too crazy, but quite original at the same time, which I like. Uh, I would say this yeah. is like your, your like vibe. Yours. Yeah, your vibe. it is definitely. <laughs> yeah. So uh, yeah, that's the last product, uh, and that's the whole advent calendar, glossy box advent calendar unboxed. What do you guys think? Um, I think this was a quite uh, makeup heavy advent calendar. It's quite a lot of makeup, uh, but like you know, just a lot of like glossy. Different stuff, but like yeah. actually, you can do like Highlighters a full face. And I think. Yeah, uh, what do you think in general? Um, I'm yeah, I'm very excited. Like, I was excited on the previous box, and I'm excited with this box as well because there are like so many stuff there. I'm like, <laughs> which yes, one is yes, better yes, yes. comparing glossy box to brush box, in your opinion? Mm, hard to say, hard to say. I think, uh, personally, I did like. Birch box a lot, but this eyeshadow palette is better. Here. Yeah, it's like, a, it's like proper, a cherry on top. Yeah, cherry on top. And there are like some cool brands like you know Huda Beauty and Fenty Beauty. You yeah. know these are like Zoeva and they're like quite pricey brands in here. So that kind of makes it like a little bit exciting. More ex because yeah, exciting can, yeah. and the box looks very expensive yeah. as well. Yeah. So I think it's so far so good. Two boxes on box, two advent calendars on box, and they're quite good, right? Very good, very good, very good. We have one more to go. Uh, we're going to unbox Look Fantastic very soon. Look uh, Fantastic. Yeah. Yes, so I'm pretty sure Look Fantastic is usually more <laughs> focused on skincare. So I'm really curious how you'll mm -hmm. actually what you think. We'll about see what's going to be like the yeah. December skincare from yeah. uh, Look Fantastic. Okay, so that's everything for today. Thank you very much for watching. If you like this video, uh, please give us a like, please subscribe, please visit Arthur's uh, social media and uh, please keep your eyes peeled uh, on his like big reveal with In his December new... for my new YouTube channel. Yeah. Amazing. So thank you very much for watching. Thank you, Arthur, for coming. Oh, you're very welcome. Anytime. And yeah, see you very soon. Bye. Oh, sorry. sorry. <laughs>